it's Christmas Eve, Teresa. This is a time for joy and for miracles. Yeah. Well, I could lose my little boy, and I could lose the man that I love tonight. Let's try not to think that way, huh? It's Christmas. We're here to celebrate the birth of our Savior. And of all nights, this is the most important night to hold on to your faith. I want to. It's just these lies. He thinks I'm heartless, but all the time, everything I do, I'm trying to do for him. I can't tell him that little Ethan is Jonathan's liver donor. I can't tell him that his son is sick. I can't lean on the man that I love for support. I know this is very hard, Mia. But you're strong. You're stronger than you think. And you're right. You can't tell Ethan that little Ethan is his son. Gwen and Rebecca have made sure of that. If you do... I know. We're all gonna die. Mama, I feel like I'm already dying. I'm not going in there. Here, Ethan's with Gwen. And they look close. Well, Teresa, it's obvious she's using their son's illness to try to win him back. And she forced me to confirm her lie that I sent little Ethan away for Christmas. I would never do that. Mm. Hopefully she hasn't caused permanent damage to our relationship. What? Teresa, you can't have him back. I have to tell him the truth. It's impossible. Why don't you go speak with Father Monaghan, huh? Maybe that'll help you feel better. Go to confession. Okay. Yeah, that wouldn't be a good idea. Oh, what is it? Everything I feared, it's it's come true. I've lost him, Mama. I've lost Ethan. It's over. It's, it's all gone. All my dreams. It, it just died. Let's go find the seat. No, you go. Um, I I want to be with little Ethan right now. Stay, please. This is God's house. It's Christmas. Time for miracles. I don't think I'm getting my Christmas miracle tonight. Did I said this is the night that we all received the biggest miracle of all. God loved us so much that he sent his only son to earth. And then he watched him die on that cross for our sins. Do you really think that a God that loves you that much... It's not going to answer your prayers. What's your Christmas wish? I do. I want Lynn Lee to be well. And I want Ethan to love me again. <laughs> In life, we don't always get what we want, Teresa. <laughs> Sometimes it's you just got to think what's most important to you. So choose, Teresa. Which one will it be? I wish I could join Ethan. There's no point. He doesn't want me to. I heard him talking to Father Lon again. It's over. I'm sorry, Mama. I, I gotta go. This is too painful. Teresa, please, me. It's Christmas Eve. Not for me. I want to go to the hospital. I want to be with my son. You know, Mama, I did pray for my Christmas miracle, but it didn't come true.
What is it? It's a text message. I've got to call the hospital. Something must be wrong with little Ethan. Who's my answer phone? No matter what happens, Mia, Mom is right here. Yes, this is Teresa Crane. Can you please tell me what's wrong with my son? No. Uh-huh. Merry Christmas to you, too. Oh, God. Oh, God. His fever broke and he's responding to the medication. It's going to be fine. Thank you, God. That's what I prayed for, Mama. I prayed for my baby. <laughs> God answered your prayers. He did. Okay. You know, maybe if he uh, heard my wish for the Lethan, maybe. I don't know he'll hear my wish for Ethan. Maybe it won't be too late, you know? I'm going to share Christmas Mass with the man that I love. I'm going to tell him how much I love him. 